Hey, Kathy. Hi. Hello, my friend, Jeanette. So what day of the week is it? It is thankful Thursday today. Which means a whole week has gone by again that we've lived our lives at work, in the community, at home, and we got a bounty of things to be thankful for. Oh boy, do we ever. Boy, do we ever. You know, it's um, it's all about those tangible and intangible things that we talk about all the time with our gratitude and appreciation. And I've had more intangible stuff. <laughs> I, um, as you know, I've been through quite a journey, particularly in the last three weeks uh, since our event on October 1st and 2nd. And, you know, there's been highs and there's been lows, absolutely. But at the end of every high and at the end of every low, I am so grateful for life and for being and being present in every moment. Like today, I had a blast teaching, a blast. I just let everything go. And uh, I took five days of bereavement, which was great. It was the best thing I ever did. Oh my goodness. So I went back to work yesterday and I was sort of catching up things, felt like I was being dumped on all day because I don't know, I just, my universe is, my universe I'm finding is not aligned with my career anymore. Okay. Gratitude and appreciation has changed the way I'm thinking and feeling a lot. Okay. And I like who I am now. Yeah. Like I've always have, but I like myself even more now as a human being. And now I'm surrounded. Oh, well, in I'm, I'm just going to pause you there for a second. Cause that's interesting that you've, you've up leveled or recognized that you're a human being first, mm -hmm. then underneath that teacher, wife, mother community volunteer music lover you've brought yourself back up here that's that's beautiful kathy yeah it's been it's a journey right yeah and and i've always called life a journey but it's just i've just reached a different level and and today i just let loose and man we had good laughs today with my kids like I just had a blast it's like this is why I do what I do I'm so <laughs> thankful for my job and I'm so thankful for my kids and and I came home to an amazing meal from my husband I'm so thankful for him and his ability to cook I have a husband that can cook and <laughs> you know and then I get this beautiful beautiful package in the mail from our friend Diane Rolston Summit speaker number one. Yep. She was our speaker number one in our first annual event. And it's signed by her and everything. And it's it's a journal um, to keep track of your weekly successes. Because remember, we always talk about celebrating what yes. celebrating our successes. Way more energy in a party. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So it's like it's it's monthly goals, weekly goals, tracking, and even has space for your gratitudes. She's got 10 different spaces for gratitudes and um, it's just amazing. I can't wait to sort of dive, dive into this. And, you know, we were talking about, um, you know, how do we give back to ourselves? Like yeah. I have in my calendar walk and sometimes I have to shift it to a different time, but I have it on an alarm on my watch, in my calendar, on my calendar, written down everywhere that this is my 30 minutes of just walking in nature. And right. I try and do that every day. Do you have a favorite tree on your trail? No. That's like Julie's thing, Julie Boyer's thing. She says, find a favorite tree and you kind of walk by it. And you know how you felt dumped on? A tree will let you dump on it <laughs> anytime you want to. And I'm I talking won't talk back. <laughs> words. I'm not talking about other things, but uh, <laughs> that your words, troubles, hugs, moments, quietness. Yeah. And when before we were getting um coming on tonight, I was saying, you know, when you said about that intangible, intangible thing, that that tool, whatever that tool is, so many times in life we feel it's a sign of weakness if we got to get a book and read it about, about gratitude, or we have to find an app that, um, or we we choose to get a that beautiful book that Diane has made. Yeah. And to me, that means we've got the strength left to reach out 
and lift it up and bring it into our lives. Isn't it all about um, self-development? Yeah, like moving really forward weird. in the world that we live in, we need to continue being aware of what we need, whether yeah. it's us as an individual or a family or a significant other or whatever, even polishing the furniture, that piece of furniture just needs a little extra polish today right? Um, there was a book, um, it was decluttering book, and it's on the Japanese method. They actually say, oh, Mario Kondo. Yeah, it's not that one. It's a different okay. one. But you're not supposed to um, bundle your socks together, your pairs. They're supposed to be free in, free in your drawer, because if you tie them up, you're walking in those socks all day long. They're working for you. And I thought, yeah. that's very interesting now I still tie up my socks but <laughs> I just thought it was an interesting because I, I need pairs I'm not random like teenagers today with they don't care if they're odd socks that they wear but, period <laughs> <laughs> but it's like being just just present just yeah. being present right yeah. yeah I I love this this is so shout out to Diane Ralston like she's she's phenomenal like like I just yeah, I love her. I love her. She well, does such great things. My daily thing that I do, and some you've been privy to it, and if I haven't done it when I've done a Zoom, is my fun affirmation cards. Uh, and yes. I, you know, um, these are affirmators. I picked them up at Save on Foods a long time there by Knock Knock. And I go through them and I cycle through them. And then I have a friend that made this beautiful ring for me um, that I've never taken off since I've had it. And he's got the wise and the wise ass sayings of the wizard. And I just get someone to, okay, count the number, pick it out. And we just share with that particular moment to bring ourselves back to the words, back to the words. These ones are pretty funny, actually. Mm -hmm. um, and, and share in it. And it's a, and it's a tool. And it's, we, there's so much out there. And also there's so much in you just saying, you know what? The tool is the time right here, right now. I just pause and yeah. do nothing. I watched a video, Kathy, yesterday of this fellow on TikTok. He says, why would I say I have to say I have plans when I say no? Like if I don't want to go out that night with you or anything like that, why can't we just accept going, you know what? I'm doing nothing tonight and nothing is a thing. I'm well, we, we, we live in a society of making excuses, yeah, right? And why do we do that? Because of the outside pressures, right? So I feel much better not having those excuses. I really do. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. So being real, being real and, and present and, and in gratitude. In gratitude. Just <laughs> having a great attitude leads to gratitude. It's, it's just, um, just magical. Just yeah. magical. Yeah, absolutely. So our, our suggestion, not a challenge. Our suggestion is if you need an app, to keep yourself in gratitude, go find one. And if it's not working for you, it's okay to put it down. Let it go like Kathy did today and enjoyed it. Find a journal, find a book, find a time on your timer on your watch. Whatever it needs to be, it's okay in order to keep you in that gratitude moment. There will be happiness, sadness, joy, bliss, angry, hopefully not so much, mad, hopefully not too much. Yeah but we can always have that tool to bring ourselves back to the yeah. gratitude and appreciation. And you know what? It's okay to be angry and it's okay to be sad. It's how you deal with the end of that. It's yeah. how you approach it and just don't do it all day long. It ain't worth the energy. And worry. Right. Stop yeah. worrying people. Yeah. We can only control so much in our lives. Oh, and I can control my tood. That's what I say. That's what I can control is my my attitude attitude yeah no absolutely well Good Kathy stuff. this is awesome and I know you're working on some special guests upcoming on our thankful Thursdays and yes yep lined up oh let's just wrap this up about Kalina tomorrow morning because there's still time to sign up for the ABCs of gratitude tomorrow morning yeah 9 30 to 10 30 and uh yeah check it out um I don't know where, is it on our website? It's on our website. It is on LinkedIn and it's on our Facebook page. See, All ready to sign up. See, and on Eventbrite and on Alignable there you and go. on Shop Langley. So if you want to come, 
yeah. I'll make sure and we're making sure it's everywhere and Kathy's emailed you and yeah it's uh it's ABC's workshop with gas yes. and uh, GAS and Kalina Donald is um I can't wait to hear her tomorrow morning she's brilliant she is yeah she should be like Prime Minister of Canada quite frankly she <laughs> She, but she's that bright, like she's really, really, really bright and has such a unique way of approaching business and benefits and doing what's right for people, individuals as individuals. So yeah, yeah. If you've got some time between 9.30 and 10.30, register. And if you register, you get a recording. So register even if you can't make it. And then you get a recording. Yeah. All right, my dear. Okay. Oh, I know. Let's go like this. Let's go. Gratitude in this hand, appreciation in this hand, and that's how you make kindness. I like it. I like it. Pump three times. One, two, three. Kindness out to the world. Yay. Have a great evening, everyone, and we'll see you next week with some special guests. Absolutely. Bye for now.